against their top player. So, you know, that was really interesting to see. And to be honest with you, both kids really held their own. I mean, there was no place to go. Bought them a little time for Spence on the delay blitz. And then, as you said in the commentary, Tough. Well, it looks like it's going to be serious because they're probably going to put him on that cart and take him off. It's Kerry Heider Jr., their defensive end, the starter in that position, and he uh, is in a second year, but very special ball player last year. He really was. He's an Eastern Michigan kid. He came out of nowhere, as you know, Don. He, he had eight sacks, which you know led their ball club last year in the absence of Ansa. And this is uh, this is a crippling blow because they're. Weakness is the pass rush overall, and they were hoping to get Ansa back at some point and uh, team him up with Hyder. This, this is a big blow here early in the first quarter to the Lions. All his teammates come over to put a hand on him. He is, he is shaken up. There's no question about it. And uh, it looks like it's a serious injury of some kind. Yeah, probably a slip. That's a big loss for Detroit because this kid can play. He really can. And, and like I said, he, he came out of nowhere. Uh, nobody expected it, and uh, so so it's really interesting. One thing I like so far, and you know we haven't been effective yet, but we are trying to get that ball out quick. And I I think that's Ryder really Junior uh, or Hyder Junior, whatever his name is. To move him at times because he is a good athlete, and then number two, get that ball out quick against his own defenses. Look at his leg or foot. Cracks. Now he got that tip. Nothing he could do about it. But I like that. It also helps those young offensive lines. The coach now have third down. So I'll see what shit. Told 